noticed that I have consulted two circuits made from basically the similar materials. Both of these circuits have 120 volt batteries and both of them have three light bulbs which have a resistance of 20 ohms, 30 ohms, and 40 ohms. The only difference is how they're connected. Notice that for the first circuit, if you imagine yourself running over the circuit, you will pass through all of the light bulbs in one go. If that happens, this is a series connection because it's a series. Now for the second connection, if you were the current running through the circuit, you'll be from the positive terminal of the battery, you'll run, and then you go here, you need to decide where you want to go. Would you go to the 20 ohm light bulb? Or to the 30 ohm light bulb? Or to the 40 ohm light bulb? Now, if you need to choose in uh, which light bulb you want to go to, then that's a parallel connection. Now, if I close the switch, observe what happens. In which connection do the bulbs go brighter? Is it in the series connection or in the parallel connection? Now, to further explore the circuit, let's try to measure the voltage and the current in each type of circuit. Now, what we'll do is I'll turn the switch on for each circuit, then measure the current in the battery and in the light bulbs using our ammeter. So when I turn the switch on and I close the circuit, this happens. Now observe what will be the values of the current. This is the current in the battery. This is the current in the first light bulb. This is the current in the second light bulb. And this is the current in the third light bulb. Do you notice something? How about the currents in the parallel connection? This is the current in the battery. This is the current in the first light bulb. This is the current in the second light bulb. This is the current in the third light bulb. Now let's move on to the voltage. Now for example, if you want to measure the voltage of this battery, you put the red terminal here. And the black terminal on the opposite end. So the voltage is this in the series connection. Now this is the voltage of the first light bulb. Now if there's a negative, you just switch them. Here's the voltage for the second light bulb. And here's the voltage for the third light bulb. How does that compare to the current? Now let's look at the parallel connection. This is the voltage for the battery in the parallel connection. This is the voltage of the first light bulb. And this is the voltage of the second light bulb. And this is the voltage of the third light bulb. Now 
notice anything? Based on those observations, try to answer the questions in your PowerPoint. Next, let's do something weird. 